Well, 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 here we are, everybody. Moving on with Jackson Wang. Got Come Alive. Yes, I am very excited. I very much liked his last song. It was like typo negative from the 70s, and I'm down for that. So I'm hoping that the uh, trend continues there. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? Okay, okay. <laughs> um, so, sticking with a little bit of the sound, 
I think the one difference in terms of sound from this to the other one, this one's a little bit more open, a little bit more airy, but it still has the same dynamicism, which I think is actually pretty cool. I'm glad that he stuck to the sound, at least from what I've heard from the two songs, because I feel like that it's something that's so different and unique that I kind of was hoping that he would kind of evolve and uh, push that sound, which I think he did here. And the nice thing is, is that even though it has a similar sound, it's not something that I would say was like a carbon copy or like, do I feel like that it was something that was an unnecessary copy of what we already have? And, uh, but I will say, I think that the uh, idea behind the music is nice because I think a lot of times we like the familiarity part of things. So I, I do, I do appreciate that for sure. I think that was actually really cool, really smart. And of course, since it's Halloween, let's talk a little bit about the uh, music video. Obviously, it's like a zombie circus, <laughs> which is actually kind of interesting. Um, I think the thing that's really interesting, though, is that I know that for a lot of people, it's really taboo. But obviously, inside of the world of horror and like just spooky stuff in general, uh, these old school um kinds of like circuses uh you know people used to call them freak shows um <clears throat> is actually still something that's really popular and in fact there is actually still like um a uh, circus that goes around obviously a lot more humane that are running a horror themed version and it's really cool and i think sometimes because of things that have negative connotation a lot of people don't want to give ethical versions of that you know like especially especially like the freak show uh much cadence because it's it's very kind of a hot topic in a lot of senses because of obviously obvious uh inhumane treatment but i for me personally i think that this is actually really cool I think there's uh, a lot of really fun stuff in this. And I actually have to say, even like from the very, very beginning, like as he's crawling the uh, other people and you see like the unicycle, the strong man, you know, the other dancers. And <clears throat> one thing that I actually really like is that when he's doing one of the dances and he comes up to the person who gets cut in half, I thought this was really clever. <laughs> One thing I actually really like is because the way that this is set up, I feel like that this was maybe a little intentional, but when we get to the point where everybody's dancing right here, you can actually see the strongman and the unicyclist in the back, which I thought was pretty cool. Looks like we got the other actors there, you know, you got the twins, and you got the fireman, you got the strongman, the stilts. Very cool. I really think this is a very clever uh, little piece of dance right here. And honestly, like even the uh, the way that the camera pans like that, I think it was actually really cool. I feel like that in terms of creating uh, a world, it, this is a really effective because you get each person's personality in small little snippets, and it it works. And I like that. I think that there's a lot of fun creativeness behind the world that is created for the music video, and so I think yeah, this is pretty cool. I, I'm liking Jackson Wayne, I'm not gonna lie. This is sick. 
<laughs> anyway, let me know what you all think, and we'll see you tomorrow for Halloween, where we join Jin of BTS going and ghost hunting, I think is what I saw. I'm not sure. Uh, and I also have another surprise for tomorrow, so keep an eye out for that. Happy Halloween, everybody. We'll see you on the actual day. Thank you. We'll see you. Goodbye.